Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to set any of the picture like the JPG or PNG as the background in your iClone 8 3D animation software just like this. Now you can see this is really cool sometimes you not even need to have a, a 3D scenes that put tons of the 3D model. Sometimes you just need to have a picture to just render some of the really simple 3D animation. So what you need is just a picture. Sometimes you can just take it easy. If it is not a movie, it is just a short descriptions of something. You just need a background. So start from now, I'm going to show you the step by step. At the first, you just have a, a piece of picture. This is what we call the picture format like JPG or PNG. How are you going to put it into your iClone 7 and also the iClone 8 to make it as a background? So I start from beginning. I just to create a fresh new project and I show you from the beginning. By default, the workplace is standard just like this. All right. So you have the project, you have the 3D avatar. So I just put a random 3D avatar here first. And then Control G is to turn on and turn off the grid. So what you need to do is just go to the window, workplace, then put it put to turn it on all the panel here. Or you can just turn on the visual effect, it's okay. So cannot. Workplace all panel. You better to have the all panels and close this, then close this as well until you can see the project. Now you have the background here. Once you can see this, then it is easy. So what you need to do is just drag the, the picture background to here. You can see drag and drop, then back to here, go back to your project. So under the project, you can see you have a background. You can activate the image here. So when you render, it is just like this. So this is the render. This is the render resolutions like this. All right. Now you can see if I render a video or picture, I click render an image first as demo. So I click just a preview render or final render is okay. I render it on my desktop. Render 01. Now actually you, you already get the picture with a background. You already get a picture with the background. This is your 3D model. So that means in your icon 8, if you do the 3D animation at here, this picture background, it can become just a background of, of your 3D animation. Sometimes if you no need a lot of the 3D background, or you can just use your 3D background to render the picture first. And when next time you want the same scenes, you just drag in the picture. It will save a lot of the system resources, like your CPU, your GPU, in order to render. The effect will be the same. You can just render it first, then put it as a background. Just for example, now I have, I have this picture. All right. So next time, let's say if you want to create some of another 3D animations, you need to use the picture. You can just drag and drop, then you can just put it as a background. That's really easy. So this is just a picture. This is iClone 7, same as iClone 8. You just need to go to the window workplace, go to the full panel, all panel, then close this, then go to the project, it will be here. Or if you want to use the background color, it's okay, deactivate it, then change the background like this, all right? So same as the iClone 8, you can deactivate it, change the background like this. So the background can be a color, it can be an image, image like this. The background, by default, it, it should be black color or something. All right, that is really easy. That's all for today about my tutorials on how to set the picture as the background for your icon 8 3D animations to make your life easy. That, all right, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my videos, tutorials, and sharings, if you feel all these tutorials and sharings are very helpful to your 3D modeling, 3D animations, and 3D game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new videos, tutorials, or sharings, you receive a notification immediately. 
See you in my next video. Enjoy happy 3D modeling, 3D animations, and 3D game developing. See you.